Saber. All What's going on guys? Bank Robber Games here with more Atomic Heart and the Annihilation robots. Instinct DLC. Humanity's Last episode we carried on making our way through this facility here and got destroyed by a lot of enemies. But hopefully things should be changing. We'll be able to get some upgrades now and we should be able to sort of fully upgrade a lot of our equipment quite soon hopefully. We should tend to get quite a lot of resources for destroying the enemies. And uh, yeah, then we'll carry on following the waypoint. Uh, having a bit of an explore and then following the waypoint. And it seems like there should be a boss battle coming up as well. So we've got that to look forward to. Something to know about this vending machine is for whatever reason. You sort of have to crouch before um, accessing it. But in terms of upgrades, we recently got the blueprint for, this, uh, for the magazine. They need a few more resources to upgrade that, but we're not far off. I'm not quite sure what's happened to the music, by the way. Hopefully it should start again. Leaps and bounds. Humans will no longer... The collective continues to conquer the world. It seems like we've completed that little loop. So I guess the only thing the next. Of statue. Is there a button underneath it? Careful, honey. If you press that, you'll set off problems you're not meant to handle. I'll figure it out. I'm not a child. Oh, my brute. I love the machismo. this container in case it's got a bit of ammo in it. That didn't go so well. <laughs> I was looking for the chandelier thing they mentioned. I, uh, I'm pretty sure we have another one in our inventory. I might put it in storage. Yeah, I might put it in storage. Oh well. I'm sure we'll figure this out. to watch out for that. I do like the little death animations.
shooting it as much as possible is probably the best idea. Gonna do another jump there. I'll save as much ammo as possible at the moment.
should get some of our energy back for firing the shotgun. Resources. Oh, what a cute little thing! It's bigger than the other. Sure, you get a gold star for today. Here, you little what fucker! You fucking fairy tale bastard! Yeah. Let's get to the shoot. You'll answer for every feather from my ass. Eat shit. <laughs> Be cool, boss fight. We're still quite near the start of the DLC, so that's one of the starting bosses. Can't imagine what it'd be like at the end of the DLC. In some ways it's just nice to fight something in a big enough area. my research to create a compound that, uh, that... Stop mumbling! Just say what you admitted to me! I just wanted there to be feelings between us, and I thought, what better way to solve this problem than with chemical processes? In other words, you brewed some love potion, didn't you, Vanya? Say it! Aliona, we're not in some fairy tale. I just wanted to ask you out on a date, but you're so uh, out of my league. You only give the time of day to Brainiacs. First of all, that's not true. Second, if you had just shown me the formula from the start, I would have dated you without hesitation. The compound is genius, Vanya. Huh? So, maybe... Maybe now we can go out, huh? I don't know. I just don't know. But if you ever try to pull something like that again... <laughs> Alright, so go in peace and fuck yourself! <laughs> I'm guessing the uh, potion work then. Uh, things seem to be bugging out a little bit. Let's see if I can reload a save and 
Hopefully you don't have to fight the boss again. Got a uh, chandelier thing. Yeah, hopefully we don't have to fight the boss again. If we do, I'll uh, do that and then meet you guys back here. So I reloaded the save. And thankfully you don't have to defeat the boss again. If you do have any issues and need to reload to save, it does save after you defeat the boss. You do need to redo everything though, unfortunately, which is a bit annoying. But yeah, the reason why that isn't opening is because... Shut the front door! If we go around the back here, we've got some more enemies waiting for us. I doubt Yeah, after you defeat those, do a bit of jamming out to the music. Um, yeah, the thing opens for you. Continues to conquer the world by leaps and bounds. All taxing and dangerous tasks will be carried out by. Fifth is ready. Mm, you're tireless, sugar. A real macho man. The collective continues to conquer the world by leaps and bounds. So, what will it be, Major? Definitely seem to be giving us a lot of resources, which is good. That's all our main abilities fully upgraded. That's quite good. Authorization. Let's see if we can get some more upgrades for our weapons actually. So that's the Secator or Cicator. Magazine fully upgraded, so it should reload a little bit faster. Which is good because it does seem to chew through ammo. Tasks will be carried out by robots. And yeah, I guess we just got one of the waypoint. I thought as well that the chandelier things were going to be on like general loot tables, but it seems like you can only get them on these plinth things. So definitely got to make sure to watch out for those, because it's quite likely that we've gone past one at some point. Chance we get. Such a huge statue in there. I shot on it, by the way. Are you crazy? I'm more than just a man. I'm a goddamn goose. I'm sick of this shit. say that curse word now? Uh, 
I read somewhere that an empty room is an opportunity. Okay, I put it together. Uh, nope. Be nice if I got like that quiet. How do I? How to hell with it? Silly rabbit, getting punched in the head. I won't hold the grudge. Go in peace and fuck yourself. You're one sick motherfucker. I think putting that one there. Really proud of myself, there you go. but I won't show it. Buckle the situation? You're going straight to the junk heap. Comrade Professor, may I ask you a question? Why isn't Mendeleev's picture on a monument at Chelome Memorial? Well, my friend, Mendeleev is one of the greatest minds. But obviously he didn't create Facility 3826, since he died before the Union. The Chelome Memorial specifically celebrates the Founding Fathers. But that doesn't mean we've forgotten the names of the great Russian scientists. We just honor them a little differently. Ah, uh, makes sense. Are there a lot of them? Scientists and complexes. <laughs> if I told you, I would have to jab you and wipe your memory. And that would negatively impact your work. Really? Well, of course not. But a secret is a secret. Mankind has taken... It seems like things are shady over here as well. I'm not sure if this area we're in is related to the story of it, it's just a side area. Access granted. Oh, 
Civ 2.0 I definitely think we're going to be heading over here as part of the story. No, I'll leave that for a second. Just find the waypoint and uh, yeah, see what has in store for us. the instantly charging heavy attack I should land some normal hits authorization okay, I seem to be giving out these things left right and center. sure where all the all things went. There aren't any colorful ones here, just gray. Take your time, darling. We need one of those. But carriers are painted in special colors. This little beauty is also painted in special color. Okay, I'll wait until the common beads join up around the carrier. It won't work, honey. This sector generates the electromagnetic trap that keeps the nasty old hag from hurting me and the boring old man from flying out. The electromagnetic... Today, with Thought now operating at 100% and the Collective coming into its own, our scientists will enjoy primacy in chemistry from now on. Globally, more than 90% of cited works on chemistry were published by our colleagues. Our less expensive and more available drugs are supplanting their counterparts around the world. And industrial chemicals everywhere proudly bear the ghost stamp. We've become a real catalyst of chemical progress, and the future has nothing but greater reactions in store for us. She will keep the beads from merging. And the second tour doesn't work. How do I even find the carrier? Dunno, honey. Think of something. Don't give me Dunno. You've got a brain the size of a planet. I dunno. I think it has something to do with like these pods. Uh, maybe splitting splitting some of them up. we have to do here but yeah i'm going to wrap this episode up here 
And then obviously, next episode we're going to move on and figure out what we've got to do with these ball robots. See them going off there, doing their thing. And yeah, kind of creepy actually. But yeah, like I said, next episode we'll get that figured out. And then maybe head over to that other area we were in and uh, see if that's got anything in store for us. It looked like there was that teardrop thing sort of floating around. So I assume it's something to do with the story there. But yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying the series so far. If you are, please like and subscribe, like and sub subscribe for more. And I'll catch you guys in the next episode.